Welcome everyone, I am the Depressed Eeyore, and this is Project Zomboid, and I think I'm in trouble because there's zombies inside this house. So, I... You notice I'm, a, I'm back at the house. I went ahead and just ran back to the house. Wasn't a big deal. I killed a few zombies with an axe. Swapped out my gear, and I've been just camping out and just eating food and all that. And apparently, uh, zombies are in my house. Like, I heard some banging, so I opened the door, and... Lo and behold, there's zombies like literally here and they saw me and I closed the door and now I'm cowering and I think I'm in trouble. So let's do this. Yeah, I'm screwed. I'm getting bitten. Yeah, I don't even know... I don't know what happened. I honestly don't. So... Well, sorry for the abrupt end. Um, yeah, like I said, I, I ran back to the house. Um, I've... I went through about 10, uh, I think it was two months in one day or so. Actually, no, that's not right. I think it was two months in like three days when I got here. And, uh, I just started, you know, eating food, doing that usual stuff, and all of a sudden they just... It looks like they, yeah, they broke all my windows. Yeah, they broke all the windows. They took out the, um, took out the door, and they were banging on other things in this area so yeah I didn't really have a way of getting out because there's no window on this side here my only chance was maybe trying to go out the window here but I mean by the time I opened the door here and looked out here they already saw me and they were running at me so yeah that's uh, what happened uh, yeah I forgot um, whenever you exit uh, out of the game, or you die, it kicks you out, so... Anyway, like I said, yeah, that's what happened. I just got swarmed. Um, they, they were already in my house. I didn't hear the uh, banging on the door, because I was just listening to other stuff while passing time. Because I was just going to go through the food I had, because I had tons of food. But, uh, yeah, that was the longest I've lived. That was two months and ten days. Um, essentially, what, you, what uh, a lot of players will do... Um, is they'll just try to get as much food as possible and then they'll just kind of dump sleeping pills and just sleep as much as possible and then eat whenever they are on the verge of taking damage from um, starvation and supposedly people have lived like years but that was like that was a really old version I don't know if it's changed much uh, since then anyway let's take a look at last stand we'll see what that does I'm probably not gonna do a full playthrough of it because I think it's just a survival mode but, I think you guys got the gist of it. There wasn't really much more to, to explore, to be honest. Um, I had Spiffo's Burger. There was Knox Bank, which I think we've ran by at one point. And there was the Fosoil um, gas station, which I was setting up, which and then I kind of forgot about it. Alright, I don't know what this does. Oh. Uh, um, I need a weapon. Oh, there they are. Baseball bats. And I'm already getting attacked. Also, apparently my character's name is Nancy Johnson. So yeah, you, this is where you literally, it's just a, um, a horde mode type thing, where they just come at you. I 
think you're supposed to like set up camp and do stuff like that and just fight off the hordes as long as possible. Alright, tell you what. Okay, why- oh. I'm not, my shotgun's not loaded. Oh, my windows are already broken. And I'm really ha Yeah, I don't really like this, simply because right now I'm having a lot of trouble clicking on this, the uh, containers. That's weird, I wasn't holding control when I did that, but whatever. Yeah, this is just a horde mode. Um, And the fact that they're not swarming in at immediately, uh, this means they're probably just spawning just outside of my vision or something like that. Or just trickling in slower. Not a big deal, but this game's not exactly designed for a horde mode. If I had my shotgun uh, instead of my pistol, I might have been able to do something about the zombies in the um, the, the house. But I'm talking I'm talking about the, the game I just lost. But um, yeah, so yeah, sorry about the abrupt end. But I didn't really think you guys wanted to watch me just run all the way back to my house because that's all I did. And then I just sat down and uh, ate food. Actually, I didn't really eat much food. I just kind of just read books and stuff like that. Until I, uh, until apparently there were zombies already inside my house. Like, I didn't even hear them. I don't know when they came. I didn't hear any event that would have caused them to migrate, so. I'm not sure what really caused it. But that's okay. Um, I'm probably going to go ahead and call this game done for now. Um, it is still an alpha, and it's probably going to be a while before, um, anything significant happens. Supposedly the next pa patch update is supposed to re-include the NPCs, but I'm probably, I'm pretty much ready to move on. I'll probably come back to this game someday, but it's not going to be anytime soon, especially with school and all that. Um, as for anything else I'll be doing for, um, what the hell is this? Berries. Let's arrive on berries. That's That's new. Okay. Never seen that before. I'm guessing that's something you can do with, like, farming as well. But, yeah. Anyway, um, like I said, I'm pretty much done with this. Uh, so, sorry for the abrupt end, but I, we did get a lot done. I got the show off quite a bit, I think. Um, as far as the map's concerned, we showed off over maybe two-thirds, maybe a little less, because I didn't really show too many of the residential areas, because, you know, they're all practically the same. Just depends on how many how many zombies are around. So yeah, I think that's it. Well, Wriggle Night Bug lasted the longest out of everybody, but uh, I think I'll go ahead and. Just, I'm probably not going to see this through. It's just zombies. I'm out of shotgun shells. Alright, enough of that. So, I am the Depressed Dior, and this was Project Zomboid. Uh, briefly as Wriggle and a little bit of the Horde mode. See you guys at the next LP, I guess. See you guys.